Jenga. And then he told us to jump off the cliff. <laughs> Okay, we in the motherfucking airport. Huh. I'm eating an almond croissant, which is why I don't have my mask on. But I was wearing it the whole month. Sam, okay, y'all. I pay for um. Can we talk about how my Lyft driver almost like? <sighs> but he almost got into an accident, like on some like serious shit. Like I don't like how I just jumped into the video. Hold on. Um, chow. Anyway, so we going on. Motherfucking vacay. A uh, bitch is flying to Cancun. No, I'm flying to Cancun and then going to Tulum. If you guys see my last video, my um, pack with me that you know that I'm going to Tulum. I'm very excited. So I'm very my first time in Tulum. Which means traveling, meeting some of my friends there. Check your solo traveling. Jonathan so, D. Going to Mexico. Stefan. You guys are excited for this, for this vacation vlog in Mexico, then give this video a thumbs up down below. Go ahead, smash that subscribe button, turn on your post notifications. I got bad videos, bad videos planned. The content that's gonna come, very excited for it. My pink frocks here. My Barbie shirt. My Barbie shirt. I can't find the exit. Oh, there it is. I'm in Mexico! I'm in Mexico! I'm in Cancun, bitches. I'm in Mexico with my stuff. I had a car arranged to pick me up from the airport, so that's what's about to happen right now. And I'm about to head to my hotel. We're in Tulum! Tulum! Look, we're outside. Look at all the palm trees. We're about to go exchange some money. Look, it has their faces on it and it's clear. I got off the plane and I was greeted with this. It's the pure and white energy for me. We just got to our hotel. Copal. Tulum. Playing and it smells so good. <gasps> it's very cute in here. It is very cute in here. And we have a little balcony. Hold on, I gotta do the full tour though. I've got to do the full tour. Look, we're in the jungle. It's so beautiful. Okay, so this is the balcony. We've got a kitchen, a full kitchen, because we got a stove and microwave. We've got, ooh, utensils, oven, coffee pot, toaster, sink. There's an AC, so it's nice and cool in here. Bridge, there's water and ice. We've got the closet. Oh, the bathroom. Okay, so closet, there's a safe, the bathroom. Oh, it's so beautiful! <laughs> I'm gonna just keep screaming the whole time. Very, very, very cute. Standing shower and the, oh! Very, very, very cute. And this is the bed right here. These lights are gorgeous. <laughs> I'm in awe at everything. 
little TV. It smells really good in here too. That view is crazy. You guys, I took a shower. I needed to freshen up after traveling all day. I literally needed to freshen up. So I took a shower, did my baby hairs. I got dressed. There's no full length mirror in here. That's literally the only thing that this place is missing. And then it would have literally been perfect. And I feel like they could have put it here where this plant is. They could have put a full length mirror and then they could have put the plant somewhere else. They could put it on the other side of the, um, the chair, but I need a full length mirror. So I'm like, taking little videos on my phone, trying to see what my outfit looks like, cause I don't know what it looks like, but I think it's cute. Let me show you. I have on this like jumpsuit situation. It's pants on the bottom, and then it's like a little shirt on the top. There's a drawstring for the waist, and underneath I have on my cell teeny teeny. Um, it's the nude color, because if I didn't wear this, then literally I would be fully exposed. My booty is out though. I have on the bottoms and then I have on my Zara little slippers for my bag that I would do my little wooden bag because that would go so freaking cute. I could do the short handle like this, which I kind of want to do, or I could do the long one. But I, because I want to have a little, a little bag. I did my skincare and I just brushed my brows up. I did my baby hairs. Um, and then I have this lip oil on, which is why my lips look so glossy. Very cute. Very, very, very cute. Ordered the chef's this chef's surprise and uh, it looks like this is sash sashimi it looks really good i'm gonna try it right now focus shrimp guayosa and then there's some like sweet chili shrimp and this is the sauce then this one the sashimi is really good said this one's salmon this one's ahi tuna or this one's ahi tuna he said this one's yellowtail and this one's eel good morning good morning morning vloggy vlog happy what's today saturday day mother oh okay i'm about to do my edges but i was like i should be vlogging i woke up Got in the shower, um, refreshed myself. I put my bathing suit on. Oh. That looks so cute. <laughs> okay, period. Um, I'm just doing my edges right now. But yeah, tell me how we went out yesterday and yeah, we got drunk. Very, very drunk, all of us. Stop. <laughs> very drunk. But I didn't wake up with a hangover or anything. Quad texted me and was like, that he woke up with a headache and he had to take some Advil or some Tylenol. Day motherfucking two into Lulu. We gotta get these baby ears together. I wanna go get breakfast right now because our hotel has breakfast. Don't play with it. I don't even know why with it. My braids look so like crazy already because of how many times they've gotten wet <laughs> but it's okay i'm going for that effortless effortless summer braided look it is what it is you can't even stress that shit right it's because my hair is so soft it literally just does its own thing some of this I'm putting some of this um, Cantu Edge Booster on my braids because they just look so crazy. Okay, I found found my sunglasses. So I'm gonna wear these, and then I put my waist beads on that my sister um, made me a really long time ago. I forgot I had these, but when I found them, I was like, "Ooh, gotta bring those." I don't know what cover up to wear. 
I really don't, but this is the outfit. <laughs> this is the bathing suit at least. Very, very cute. I love it a lot. I love it a lot. I'm about to go get breakfast because a bitch is fucking hungry. I'm always hungry. Like, I'm literally, I always want to eat. I just want to eat. I just want to eat. I just want to eat. Come on, let's go. For which one? Enjoy? Yes, yes. Mm, yummy. It's really the scenery for me. We're at the pool and we're going to eat breakfast. Good morning, Mexico. Good morning, Tulum. Babe, say good morning. Good morning. my food. I got a fried egg. It came with some sausage, some bacon, and waffles. Maybe got the same thing. Yes, um, I'm on the roof. making me wear this. like a knockout. If it's light work, then I'm gonna cross out. really crazy and you guys probably also don't recognize the room we're in and that's because we got a room change our toilet broke last night like we thought it was clogged but it actually broke like it broke and it was leaking and then when we woke up like we had, we had a repairman come and fix it um last night before we went to sleep and then we passed out and we woke up literally like the entire bathroom was flooded there was like i would say like three inches of water just like sitting on the floor and then it started to like kind of like seep into the walls so we had to let obviously management know and they gave us a room change but i don't think we're staying in this room either because this is a very very big room it's a two bedroom so i'm just gonna show it to you guys just because like maybe if you want to come stay at this hotel and you're thinking about coming with a larger group um you can do that i have a towel on i know i look naked 
it, but I have a towel on. So this is the door. Yeah, this is the front door. So you come in here and as soon as you come in, you have the kitchen to your right. This is a fully stocked kitchen. You got some bar stools here. On one side, you get a full fridge, stove, oven, coffee, toast, toaster, you know, everything, microwave, literally like in the last location that we had, but you know, just bigger. And then you have over here, a little dining table area with the same kind of vibe going on. And then all along this wall is a huge balcony. And then we've got the couch, a little seating area, you know, there's a TV. I love the lighting along the banister. AC and then along this wall from the door you have like another really big window You've got a closet here. You've got one bathroom here This is not a full it's a half bath because it's just the sink and the toilet But very cute closet to your left. You have one bedroom This is um, I believe like the main bedroom windows there's like no view out of this one because we're in the back you have another bathroom this is a full bathroom it looked just like the last one um you know and then in the here you have a closet like a little walk-in closet the last one didn't have a closet a walk-in closet it just had like a standalone closet so much bigger Definitely a lot bigger and then straight across the hall you have another room This is a two-bedroom room. These are like two twins. I think if you want to share you Got that same situation AC closet and then another full bathroom Do, 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 do. do I look tan? I feel like I I definitely got a tan actually. You can see my tan. So yeah, I'm about to take a shower, but I'm gonna do it in the other bathroom. vlog is still going i have the biggest mosquito bite on the back of my shoulder and i just keep itching it we're day four right friday saturday sunday monday yeah day four of the vacation vlog in tulum i honestly i was so hungover from yesterday i went out 
my friends and we did a lot of drinking and a lot of shots of a lot of different tequilas and and just stuff a lot so i'm i was really hung over this morning they actually all went to do excursions at like 8 a.m and I woke up because I set an alarm, but then I overslept. Fell back asleep, so you know what? It's okay. I've got my bathing suit on. I've got my cell teeny keeny on. You guys have seen this before because I've worn it a couple times. And then I have my Atira Lions scarf to match because the braids are getting so fuzzy. <laughs> These pink shades that I got off of Santee Alley, they were literally seven or eight dollars. They were in my haul. I just ordered room service for breakfast to the room. So let's go eat. Oh, and I don't know if you guys noticed, but we actually got a new room. There was this whole situation that happened yesterday morning and we ended up getting an upgrade because it was very necessary. Our old, basically our old room got flooded, so they put us in like the nicest room in the in the hotel, one of the nicest rooms. So now we have like two beds, three baths, we have stairs, I'm about to go up the stairs. But yeah, we're in a, a different room now, and the room we have now has a pool in it, which is very nice. But this is upstairs. kitchen we have a bathroom here a half bath that's a closet and then if you come out this way that's the front door or what well, I think yeah the front door you know here we have a jacuzzi a jacuzzi isn't it so pretty? We just got to the C note that we're going to, the um, the cave. He said, all you need is your bathing suit and your towel. Maybe I'll just bring my towel and wrap it around me. I should have worn my one piece bathing suit. you saw me i was at the cenote cenote the cave the underground cave um and then we got food our tour guide ernesto brought us to like a traditional little mexican spot and we had some good food i actually want my leftovers because you know you know me i ain't finished my food <laughs> i had some leftovers as much as i love to eat i don't know ever since i started working out pretty consistently i feel like my metabolism has sped up a lot more and i eat less and i get fuller faster so i didn't finish my food i didn't take a picture of this outfit like this is so cute this is the zara little knitted shorts that are the comfiest pair of shorts i've ever owned like these are just so freaking comfortable and then this little linen top it's so freaking cute like i love these are my last here 
came back and I literally like I needed a nap so bad. I was so freaking tired. Um, and that's because I we was out like we were in the sun, but we were in the caves and we were swimming, swimming around, swimming, swimming, swimming. And Nesto made us dive off of a freaking little cliff within the cave in the dark. We had these two like waterproof flashlights and he was like okay turn your flashlights off and i was like huh he was like turn them off and i turned it off and like literally like standing on the cave standing on the cliff inside of the cave turning off the light it was pitch black like it was so dark you couldn't even see your hand being held up right in front of your face like that's how dark it was and then he told us to jump off the cliff oh my god i was at first i was kind of being a little pussy i was like i was like i can't do it it's pitch black i don't know where i'm gonna jump what if i jump and i hit my like what if i jump and i like hit my arm or my head or my leg or something like on a part of a rock that's what i'm worried about i'm always like my biggest fear god forbid is getting freaking injured i don't want to get injured i like doing stuff i like having fun but i don't want to get injured i'm always like fearful that i'm gonna like fall off of something or like i'm freaking out but i just be worried you know fall break something but i don't even like speaking about it because i feel like you're speaking it into existence and i don't even want to do that that's how that's how serious it is for me okay but these are our leftovers I showed you what they look like though, but this food was so freaking good. So put it in the microwave. Yeah, so I came back here and I fell out. I laid down on the couch with my little dirty self. And I pissed the fuck up. I was not getting in the shower so I could get in the bed. I fell asleep on the couch. I feel like I need to wash my lashes and I brought the shampoo and the little lash brush to wash them. But I'm afraid that when I do it, it might make the lashes drop out more, like some more. Like I've lost a couple, but really not um, a lot. I actually really, really love the girl that did them because the retention on them is just so good. Like in the past when I've gotten my lashes done, even after having them like the first night, I wake up and there'll be lashes on my pillow. That was not the case when I got my lashes done this time around. I'm gonna have the girl, if you're in LA, downtown LA, um, you know, she's in downtown LA, but if you're in LA, you want to travel to downtown LA to get your lashes done. Girl, she hooked a bitch. Ah, okay. I showed her a picture of what I wanted. It was actually of her work. And then we kind of like elaborated on it, you know, because I got to tweak it and customize it so that it's perfect for me. But yeah, I absolutely love the way she did my lashes. And the main reason is because of the retention. They're still doing what they need to mother motherfucking do very full sit poolside and just hang out because it's nighttime now i know i have massages scheduled in the morning so i want to go and get a massage and then there's like a little jacuzzi next to the massage but i also do have a jacuzzi in my room now so it's not even like i need to like be in that one because i got a personal one <laughs> Good morning, vloggy vlog. Happy Tuesday. It's Tuesday. It is my last full day in Tulum, Mexico. I'm about to go and get a massage. I need this. Like, I really need the massage. I'm feeling like I need to be rubbed out because your girl just got a lot of tension, a lot of stress, you know? Like, and I've honestly been wanting a massage for so long now. So, very, this the baby is for me always. Literally always. Let me show you my bathing suit. Okay, so I have on this really cute one piece. Absolutely love this bathing suit so much. Okay, let's go get finished our massage and I'm so I'm so relaxed right now you guys have no idea they did such a good job she rubbed me out so good very very relaxing and we're about to get in the jacuzzi now and they're gonna give us a bottle of bubbly so we can stay in the jacuzzi but it was so good I'm so like well moisturized too 
Like I'm oiled up now. I needed that. I needed that so bad. I'm so good right now. So so good. guys Ooh. <laughs> I'm headed to actually go get tested for COVID right now I have my mask in my bag I'm about to put it on before I get in the cab but yeah when traveling back I don't know why it's not focusing on me when traveling back into the US you have to get tested three days prior at least three within three days three calendar days of your flight so I'm about to go get tested because I leave tomorrow I'm about to do it you guys go ahead you're feeling me? <laughs> yes. Okay. <laughs> Hola. Hola. Give me your pillow. Sit down there, please. Okay. <laughs> okay. I'm going to insert a swab inside your nose, and maybe you feel like you want to sneeze or cough, maybe tickles or ice water is normal. Okay. So show me only your nose, please. Cover the mouth and raise your head. A little more, please. Like that is perfect. Sorry. Give me a second. That's it. Oh, that wasn't bad. Great. Oh, okay. That's yes. Bye. It wasn't that bad. You're just a drum drama queen. Oh my god. Dang. It just tickled a little. No, it did not tickle. That wasn't bad, you guys. Oh, this is cute. I'm on a swing at a bar. Papaya smoothie. It's papaya and pineapple. And I'm over here responding to comments. Gracias. Yeah, I don't be working so far and stuff. Is this enough? What's the name? No, no, nombre? Rambutan. 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 Gracias. Rambutan. You guys, guess who's getting ready for dinner? Me. It's our last night in Tolulu. It was only right we ended off with a bang. Going to dinner, and I'm about to do my makeup, so I'm gonna vlog it. Um. Yeah, I don't want to do anything too dramatic. I do have a pimple that I was picking at earlier that I popped. Yeah, I haven't put on makeup this entire trip. So, I actually want to start off with brushing my teeth just so we have a nice clean mouth. Can you guys believe that the hotel lost my toothpaste? My charcoal toothpaste? I got a tan, so I'm like kind of nervous because I don't know if my makeup is gonna match. I brushed my brow hairs up. I'm sweating. I'm like hot. I'm not even gonna put makeup on my forehead with the way that I'm sweating. I got bit by a mosquito on my forehead, but then I also started to break out. My face wasn't clean and I went to sleep and my face just I was like, girl, you playing games with us, so we finna show you. I'm gonna just apply this to my brow so they can be set in place while I'm doing the rest of my face. These two concealers. This one's from the lip bar. This is their quick conceal. Caffeine concealer in the shade 3.0 caramel and I put a little bit On the corners little pimples that I have right here a little breakouts Because this one when it dries down it dries down and it does not budge But I let it sit before I blend it out and then I'm gonna take my Fenty Beauty concealer in the shade 330 I don't know if you guys can tell but it's definitely more yellow and that's it. I'm not doing foundation, that's too much. It's so, I'm literally sweating. It's so, like, so hot here. I'm gonna go with my Fenty Beauty Match Thick and Truffle. And I'm gonna cream contour just a little bit. I have to bronze my skin, but I'm not doing, I normally like swipe it on, but now I'm kind of tapping and blotting it on because I want it to be 
softer. This is like my no makeup makeup. And I'm just blending out the contour first. This is my foundation brush. <laughs> the contour like barely bronzed me because it's so close to my actual skin tone now. I love it here. I'm gonna actually stop talking. Guys, I had a lot of fun in Tulum. This was my first time being here. Like I've said it a million times throughout the vlog, but I definitely, definitely, definitely want to come back. It's such a beautiful place, such a beautiful city. It's so beautiful. This hotel is gorgeous. And I'm obsessed. Give it, give it a second to be blended out, but it's definitely getting good right there. Oh yes, this is very cute. Saucy Beverly Hills Loose Setting Powder in Deep Peach. But this one's a little darker and I knew I was gonna get tan, so I brought this one. But I was using this before I got tan, but it like neutralized my under eye. It didn't make it super bright. It wasn't it wasn't a brightening powder. It was more so just like closer to my skin tone to kind of just set. But I really like this powder. If you want a brighter one, I would definitely do a lighter shade than Deep Peach because it's definitely the darker. Oh my god, I don't have setting spray. And it's because I couldn't get a travel size one. I'm gonna bronze. Ooh, this bronzer. Yeah, this is what I needed. Blush is on. You guys, I want to do a, I want to do an eye look, but then again, I don't because I have lashes, and I don't want to have to take off eye makeup later. This is my Benefit Brow Pencil in the shade four, and Diamond Balm Highlighter in how many carats? Yeah, I'm just gonna. It's definitely there. Give me a little second. I'm gonna do something in the inner corner. Yeah. My nose is glistening, honey. I'm do some shoulders. Look at my tan. Your girl is tan. In the clavicle, you wanna hit the clavicle. Go to hit the collarbone. This is why I love this highlighter because it acts as a highlighter, but then it also can act as a body glitter because there's no, there's really no pigment to it. It's just shimmer. No. Mm -mm. Put the button up shirt on. You cannot wear a t-shirt. What is wrong with you? I love the button inside. Um, yeah, anyway, so for my lip. cork lip liner and then I have this Fenty Beauty Gloss Bomb and Honey Waffles. This color is so pretty. Um, I'm gonna use my dose of colors, lip gloss, and honey I'm pumping. This one's lighter. Okay, so this is the makeup. This is the makeup. Now I just need to do my hair.
Okay, so my makeup and my hair. I have my outfit on. I'm gonna put my shoes on and then I'm gonna show you the full outfit. Okay, so I got my outfit on, shoes and all. I on this pink dress. My hair is wet and it's wetting my dress. But I have on this pink satin dress. I know a ton of you guys are gonna ask me where I got it from. I got it off of Santee Alley. It was like one of those like random boutiques. I don't even know the name of it. But I just saw it on a mannequin and I was like, I need this. So I have on this little pink satin dress. For my shoes, I have on my Bottegas. These are new. These are my new babies. Aren't these so freaking cute? If you guys watched my pack with me video, then you saw these. Pop a shoe cam. Look at my. Oh. Then I have my lace by Tanaya anklets on, and I'm just, I'm literally obsessed. Like, these are so freaking cute, and they're not even hard to walk in because the heel is not tall. And then for my bag, I was gonna carry my Gucci bag, but I don't think it goes with my outfit, like, at all. It really doesn't go with my outfit. Oh wow, makeup from my real cute. Yeah, so we're about to head to dinner. We're going to a steakhouse. We're going to Bach, B-A-K steakhouse. Very good food apparently. I'm very excited. I want to eat a nice steak.